despite worries about thin ice, officials say there were no safety issues during the annual ice fishing derby in New Hampshire this weekend. The event was almost canceled thanks to some weak ice, but organizers say the derby was a success. Also today, one lucky angler, one big for a big catch. WMUR's Mike Cronin joins us live now from Meredith. Yeah, Stephanie, lots of winners this weekend. This is the prize board behind me. About 3,400 people fished in this weekend's derby. That number is down one third from last year, but organizers are still happy with the turnout, just given what the ice conditions were this weekend. But the happiest person tonight is the winner of $15,000. Take a look at this video showing his reaction when his name was called. Celebrating there with his buddies, Joshua Philbrick of Kittery, Maine is taking home the top prize. Yesterday, he and his friends were fishing in Alton Bay. He caught the biggest rainbow trout of the weekend. The names of anglers who had the heaviest fish in seven categories were put into a bag and three grand prize winners were randomly drawn. Philbrick couldn't believe he won. It's awesome. I'm just, uh, I was so scared they were going to cancel the derby and they pushed it back. And the funny part about it was, was the original weekend of the derby, we had booked a weekend away up in Moosehead and we weren't going to be able to fish the derby and the date changed and we were allowed to fish it. And here we are, 15 grand, holy cow. <laughs> holy cow is right. Phil Brick says that he's going to put some of the money towards his plow and he's also going to spoil his one-year-old son. Reporting live in Meredith tonight, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.